Hey, the Gizwiz, at a recent toy event, I saw a lot of things you would expect to find at a toy event. A lot of construction toys, a lot of electronic toys, a lot of apps for kids, a wristwatch that shot video, wine, bead making, wine? <laughs> yes, <laughs> because this was a toy event for adults to find out about kids' toys. And that's where I learned, actually I knew about Zips, but I never actually opened one or tasted one. These are uh, Zips, but they spell it Z-I-P-Z. -Z. And the object here was to come up with a portable way to take wine to picnics, to the outdoors, even for travel. And they came up with zips, and they're unbreakable. They're also kind of leak-proof, because I asked the zips people if I could get one of the four different kinds, and they said, sure. And I threw them in a shopping bag, and they were upside down all over the place in the shopping bag. No problem. Nothing leaked out. And the vineyard they come from is a California vineyard called Fetzer, F-E-T-Z-E-R, in Hopland, California. So um, I'm assuming we don't need screwdrivers, tools, whatever. So for the first time ever, uh, I will open the zips. Dennis, it looks like there's Merlot, Cabernet, Chardonnay, and Pinot Grigio. Which would be the sweetest? They're all the same. They're all, they're all basically the same. Okay. <clears throat> I know nothing about wine. Uh, years ago, William M. Gaines, the, the uh, founder and publisher of Mad who loved wines, took me to a wine event. It was $100 a person. I said, Bill, it's ridiculous. He said, you're my guest. I said, I know nothing about wine. Take somebody that would, you know, enjoy. He said, come along. We'll just have laughs. So after four hours of tasting every conceivable kind of wine, Bill said, did you learn anything? And I said, Bill, I can tell a white from a red in a minute. Okay. All right. So this is... I'm looking at the side here. It looks like <clears throat> looks like a zipper here. So I assume we. Uh, oh, okay. I'm gonna show you. So you pull on the zipper, and that opens that. And then, oh, okay. Now this peels off. And now, oh, this comes off. And at the show, they told me that the cap can go on the bottom as a coaster. So I'm putting that on the bottom as a, to as, a, as a coaster. And now the opening of the... Oh, this is pretty. This is really neat. Uh, let me see what I opened here. I opened a Chardonnay. Oh, wait a minute. Chardonnay 2012. Did they not have any 2014 wine? I always, I, I always like new wine. Um, all right, so I'm going to taste it, but, oh, look at that. This, this is very clever. This hangs on to the glass. Actually tastes very good to me. Um, and also, I was worried that the price was going to be something ridiculous. There, I'm going to look on a cheat sheet here. You can get a four-pack sampler for and they expected in stores they would sell for about three fifty, and the four pack is thirteen ninety nine. So it's PET plastic, looks like traditional glassware, recyclable, and I think if you're traveling and you want to carry wine with you in a really convenient way, this is certainly a solution to that. And they are at Zips Wines Z. I P Z wines dot com. All right, so I'm just going to finish this here and really make some weird videos. Dick Bartolo, Mads, Mads, right, and it goes with to your health.